Grace Logan right now. Guys, there's a passport for you. You need a pencil? From the table, guys. You're welcome. Thank you. Make sure all the parts fit together. I'll make blueprints of all these things. I'll send them to the prototype shop. They'll manufacture them. I'll do all the layout work to make sure the parts always fit together because some parts come out a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller. You always want to make sure they fit because when you start producing 100,000 of these and they don't fit, it's a lot of money. you got to throw parts away. I'll probably get fired. So you got to make sure it's done right. So I focus in on a design like this. Sharon's a project manager. She, she, she kind of tells us all what to do. So the product that we make is for uh, sports medicine. So if a basketball player, football player, soccer player blows out their knee, damages their shoulder, ankle, hip, wrist, or anything like that, we make the tools that make the repair. So say when a football player blows out his knee, the tendon will tear away from the bone. It's easily attached like this. We'll use the electrosurgical device to actually burn away the old tissue. The doctor will drill a hole. They'll load up the new tendon. They'll put a screw in to fasten it tight. It's got to be nice and tight before we get that So you guys interested in design, medical, or you're trying to figure out what you want to do? She doesn't have to say nothing. There's two other people next to her that can ask questions. Don't be shy. That was kind of a bummer. They only took like 55 pounds, so like sometimes it takes like 250 because pasta. You get the pasta. Hi, I'm Maria Ponce and I'm the principal here at Durfee High School. I'm here at our uh, career fair where our sophomore class is actually here exploring the many opportunities that are await them as they um, go out into the work world. So um, we have many partners here um, teaching our students about um, what, what they need to do and the pathways they need to um, explore for future careers. My dad's gonna be like, alright, you didn't get arrested, you put one on. <laughs>